Hi everybody, I'm Spicy Luigi. I'm back. Check out uh, the new short that we made. We made two new shorts. One's coming out about like two or three minutes after this video. So when you're watching it, there's probably two new shorts, which will put us at three shorts. Enough talking about shorts. I've noticed it in a lot of my videos. Oh, by the way, that's Spicy Mario. I literally forgot about him. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Spicy Mario. I notice in a lot of my videos I've been doing this. I, and, uh, yeah. So, oh, and that's where it blocks you from seeing me, right? So, I'm going to try to be doing this from now on. Or you could just not do it at all. You're right. Oh, uh, why, why, the hat why, is back. Why do we have such an absence? I've had strep twice. The stomach flu once. And uh, I threw up on the ground and my dad's allergic to puke. So that was a whole disaster. My dad got sick. Yeah. So, oh, yeah. So what are we doing today? Hey, Mama. Where did we get these? Uh, my really good friend, um, which is just a couple houses away, Amara. Mm hmm And? And Remy. Who is her? Brother. Bigger or littler? Little. Okay. Um, Amara would want us to make sure that we said that. Uh-huh. And... My friend Josephine from church suggested no milk for 2023. So, uh, let's yeah, get her yeah. done. Yeah, that's why you don't see any milk around us. That's pretty much it's all the boring stuff. Now we're gonna do the hot sauce. Well, let's learn a little bit about our hot sauce today. Okay, so this is called K Mama Hot Sauce. This is made here in Minnesota. We uh, and I'm going to butcher the pronunciation, mm -hmm. but uh, this uh, sauce celebrates the Korean concept of gochujang, which you know, of course. That it, sounds like something from Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings. Well, eh, kind, of, nah, not, kind of not really, no. But anyway, gochujang is fermented red pepper paste, and that's part of the, the base of the sauce. We're gonna eat. So you know how Tabasco had red pepper in it. Yeah. This had this has a uh, uh, pepper in it too, but it's fermented paste. What pepper is it? It's the red pepper. So it shouldn't be that so, bad because we've had a couple red peppers. Yep. I I know Tabasco has red pepper. I believe Red Hot. Right? Yeah, Frank's Red Hot is based on that too. All right, so we're gonna start with the mild because. The nice thing about K-Mama is it comes in all sorts of different styles. Uh, the good news, it is uh, spicy, regular, mild. We're going to try the, the mild and then the spicy tonight. There's also original, but we didn't put that in the video. Yeah, and it's, and it's vegan friendly. So ready? Down the hatch. And I believe it's gluten-free. It is gluten-free. That's correct. So, uh, not that spicy at first, but then, yeah. It's kind of like a really bold barbecue sauce, and then heat comes in right at the end. And they say that it's buttery. Can you taste the butter? A little. Yeah? It's a smooth sauce, and the heat is consistent. Yeah. Are you starting to regret Jose taking Josephine's challenge of no milk? No, not really. Okay. It's actually not very bad. Well, the good news is... For me. That was the mild. Wait, what? So that was great. And we're going to move on to the hot stuff now. And the spicy stuff. Okay. So I do think, you know, especially if you're trying to figure out how to eat a little healthier, uh, maybe not have as much sugar like you have in barbecue sauces, this is a great alternative. If you like spicy food. It's definitely got some zip to it. You could get this at your local hot sauce store, I bet. It's also on Amazon. And they also, it's also on uh, their website, which is uh, K-Mama Foods. I just would like to mention. Yeah, do you see how the, the red pepper looks... is separating to, is to promote more anger on the chip? Yeah. Yeah. I noticed. Plus, 
it, that's the celebratory go to It looks a little bit less dark than the mild one. Well, let's find out. Ready? It's probably going to be more. Down the hatch. Definitely the same thing. It's a, it's a lighter start. It, I don't really taste any spice so far. There it is. At the yep. end? Yep. I did, that, I did. Ooh. Ooh, Josephine. Not that bad. <laughs> Not that bad. <laughs> I think the mild one's more spicy. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. No, the aftertaste is very spicy. Yeah, there, oh, there it comes. Whoa. I'm okay. Are you okay? <sighs> what do you think this would be good on? I think this would be good on shrimp, some chicken. Maybe some eggs. Like a noodle dish. Yeah. Eggs would be delicious. Mm. And obviously. I can definitely see oh, this. Oh, mm, back of my sinuses. Keeps going back and it's like, it's like, it's just got it's like, little circles. So it looks, it's, it's like there's, it's circling. It's like those, there's a bomb that it explodes, then it regenerates, explodes again about through two to three minutes later, then keeps doing it because that's what's happening in our mouths. We are seriously going to have to reevaluate our policy of taking challenges from girls at church. No, no. I I think it's a good challenge, and uh, it's not that hard. Okay. <laughs> Honestly. So what what else do you think we would be K Mama would be good on? Or I bet if you're trying to make it like a spicy sandwich or taco. Okay, now it's extra spicy. Yeah. It's, you could definitely put both of these. I'm saying if you want some spicy sooner, you should try the mild. But if you want more spicy but you want to wait a little bit, you should try the spicy version. Because you have to wait about 20 to 30 seconds. Yeah, that's true. It's a consistent spice, too. And it's it's nice. The heat is good. It's not overpowering. It's consi I like it. Like it. I don't get the buttery flavor and the, and the spicy version as, as you do in the mild. What do you think? Can you taste the butter? If you lick your lips after it, you need to sort of taste the butter. Okay, here. Hold on. Hold on. Still? Mm hmm Yeah. Okay. So, uh... Shout out? That was very good. So, I want to see an after we've tried it before reaction. Because it was delicious. Well, it was delicious. Thanks to the good people that came, Mama, and also our friends of the show, Amara and Remy, for giving us uh, the sauce. No, I'm really saying we should try them both combined. Okay. You're the doctor. Mm -hmm. I'm going to work breakfast in 10 minutes. Probably. Seems like a good choice now, though. Uh, all right. Let it rip. <laughs> you got mild and hot. Are you and well, no, with no milk? No way, man. Go for it. Tell, talk us through what you're Not feeling. that bad, but then I know what's going to happen. I'm going to say it's not that bad, and then patooing. Patooing? Yeah, that's the sound I made. All right, well, now that, now that you're waiting for the spice to come in, why don't you do your okay. shot? There it is. Oh, there. <laughs> Ah, there it is. It's so good. Woo. You can definitely try them both combined. That is woo. delicious. Can you do a Ric Flair woo? Woo. woo. Yeah, all right. Woo. Take it home, Spicy. So, basically, them both combined equals something very flavorful. So, if you have them both and you've tried both, I definitely... Okay, okay. I definitely recommend, recommend trying the both at the same time because that was very good. Okay. You want to do shout outs or should we call it there? Yeah. Shout outs. Shout outs to Amar and Remy for getting us these amazing hot sauces. Thanks, guys. Shout out to Josephine for. The no milk? Yeah. Yeah. It's hard to speak when it's really hot. I know. 
Shout out to Benny. Benny! Shout out to Jack for being Benny's brother. Good job, Jack. We acknowledge you. And Wesley for being our second biggest fan. Thanks, Wes. And, and always the lady behind the camera. Yeah, and Spicy Peach. All right. So we got a lot of a lot of a uh, lot of uh, spicy foods that we're going to be getting into. We're going to get more into a regular oh. cadence with our 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 uh, spices because Spicy Luigi got a lot of presents for Christmas this year yeah, that are so. spicy. And also, so one last shout out: the good people at Tabasco have been sending us some cool products that we're going to be previewing in future episodes. Yeah. Thanks, everybody. And I'm back. I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. Don't comment. Don't and, and don't comment because you're a little kid. I don't know why I said comment. Just let's just uh, pretend I think that never heat, happened. The heat's taking over. Bye, everybody. Bye. Is it, is it